currently the nft technology is being used for digital items such as digital arts virtual goods sports collectibles and even for scientific data the potential of the technology is far more than that and it can solve some real world challenges let us first understand the possibilities non fungible tokens offer ability to create unique immutable entities with distinguishable parameters on distributed systems perpetual and immutable self executing contracts immutable digital footprints on decentralized shared ledger that is unique transfer history for each token so the idea behind ERC721 is that it can be used to represent ownership of something while the legality of ownership claims using nft is still obscure the authors of eip721 emphasized that nfts can be used to represent ownership of physical assets such as houses virtual collectibles such as digital arts and even negative value assets such as loans depending on how the regulatory environment and technology matures NFTs may grow beyond digital assets and can be used to track real world ownerships and liabilities. But proof of ownership is not the only benefit that NFTs can offer. Another major advantage NFTs offer is tracking of ownership changes. As transactions of NFTs are on blockchains, NFTs leave immutable digital footprints in shared ledgers. The digital footprints is accessible and auditable by anyone. So let us talk about some potential use cases. First, real estate. Consider the complicated world of real estate, mired with frauds and illicit transactions. The real estate industry faces various challenges such as fake ownership, disputed ownership history, reversal of contracts. and deliberate project delays nfts can make the ownership history openly accessible to anyone increasing trust in the industry another use case of nft in real estate can be the issuance of nfts by real estate developers at the time of booking with contractual terms locked in the smart contracts automating various actions in the case of contract breach Another area that NFTs can be used is fractional ownership. Recent trends in NFT may lead to complete reform of fractional ownership. A protocol, Fractional, allows users to fractionalize NFTs into smaller tokens and use them for multiple purposes including in DeFi platforms. As NFTs can represent real-world assets and liabilities, Fractionalization brings exciting opportunities such as fractional ownership of real estate or other physical assets. Another area is securities. In the long run, NFTs and fractionalization may be used for security issuance. One use case may be for infrastructure project financing or by startups to finance their ventures. Remember that NFTs can be used to represent ownership of liabilities as well. An interesting use case for NFTs can be tokenizing liabilities such as mortgages and then use DeFi to securitize them to create new asset classes. Apart from these, NFTs can completely change identity verification. passports driving licenses and tax identities can be issued as nfts on blockchains and then accessed decentrally for verification purposes a move towards this direction came from wisekey who announced the use of nfts for digital identity verification of valuable objects another area is vehicle and equipment registration Current vehicle and equipment registration processes are heavily reliant on centralized databases. This leads to limited interoperability, 
limited accessibility, duplications and frauds. Registration of vehicles and equipment on NFTs may enable universal accessibility and verifiability. This can also make tracking ownership changes much easier. There is no doubt that NFTs offer significant potential to drastically disrupt various industries. The major impediment is how regulators react to the adoption of NFTs and how effectively the NFT ventures can accommodate existing regulations in their systems. With this, this is Sam Ghosh. Bye-bye.